So what is going on guys, my name is Mehul and welcome to your ninth Electron tutorial in which I'm gonna touch a little about what global shortcuts are in Electron and rather what accelerators are in Electron. So accelerator is just a fancy name for a string which consists of a set of keyboard keys, right? It's super easy and super simple to do you need to import global shortcut first from electron package and again again as i said it would be some sort of name and electron object or whatever we are importing so we need to make sure that you're just doing global shortcut here then once you have done that what you need to do is you need to register your global shortcut right now by registering a global shortcut you can enable the user to work with uh, their keyboards only instead of just always making use of mouse to fire some custom events right and more likely if you plan to create a game with uh, html5 and html5 canvas and all that good stuff which is actually a great idea by the way then you can pretty much uh, provide some sort of cheat system but I guess you can just do that from JavaScript as well but anyways you get the idea so you would pretty much need it uh, um, to fire the functions whenever your window is in focus or maybe even if it is not in focus and some other app is not eating your events right so that is one advantage of global shortcuts over the register shortcut with javascript and render process so you're going to say robot global shortcut dot register and then here goes the accelerator which is the name of the keys you need to press in order to get to your um, this method calling and this would be a function and all that code right here would be automatically called whenever your accelerator is uh, found by electron and for the accelerator what we can do is say command or control plus any other key let's just say one so what this means command or control it means that either command plus one which is for mac or control plus one which is for windows and linux pcs so this kind of targets it at once you can simply do command plus one as well or control plus one as well but command or control is just uh, just makes life a bit easy if you want to target both windows and mac at the same time for the same code so now whenever we press command or control plus one what i can do is uh, pretty much move my this thing right here let's just say right here and we can change this window to win so what we are essentially doing now is uh, we are saying that control plus one would be a shortcut to maximize or unmaximize our window right so let's just see so if we run this and if i press control one you can see that our windows maximized not really you cannot see the toolbar is actually overflowing for you but i can see that it is maximized maximized unmaximized maximized unmaximized and it's all with control and one right so similarly there are a lot of other events you can specify like uh, alt plus one which would fire whenever alt keys press you can just simply say here alert alt key pressed right and then you can pretty much do like uh, i don't know something like shift plus one or um, super plus one as well as far as i remember super key is that window flag on your keyboard that key is super key right so that kind of could be useful for you in your application and again all these strings right here are called accelerators and you need to register an accelerator with global shortcut now you can target a lot of keys with these accelerator like uh, numbers letters and uh, uh, pretty much everything you have or you would need on your keyboard you can target that even function keys i guess something like that 
f11 or f12 or whatever so yeah that is how pretty much you register for an event in electron and uh, that might be actually a lot helpful if you are creating an app something like a text editor where you can just say control o is for open file control p for print and uh, all that good stuff so that is all for this one and in the next one we're going to discuss something again amazing about electron i don't know what but that would be amazing so that is all for this one and if you liked it then don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like the video and that's all for this i'll see you then in the next one